Vice President Joe Biden, the front runner among Democrats for the 2020 nomination, just made big news on abortion, potentially very big news in his run for the White House. At a Democratic fundraiser in Atlanta just moments ago, he reversed himself on the law barring federal funding for abortion, known as the Hyde Amendment. He based his decision on his notion of fairness to women of all incomes. I can't justify leaving millions of women without access to the care they need and the ability to, con to exercise their constitutionally protected right. If I believe health care is a right as I do, I can no longer support an amendment that makes that right dependent on someone's zip code. Let's go now to CNN's Arlette Sign. She is traveling with the candidate, covering Biden during this rate. Arlette, uh, quite a turnaround, quite a clear-cut one. What's behind this decision? That's right, Jim. It was just a little over 24 hours ago where the Biden campaign confirms that the former vice president did, in fact, uh, support the Hyde Amendment. You saw these uh, Democratic candidates, a large group of them, really come out and criticize Biden immediately, really exposing one of the first major fault lines uh, between Biden and the other Democrats in the 2020 field. But today here in Atlanta, just inside this room next to me, Biden did reveal that he is, in fact, going to support Support repealing the Hyde Amendment, uh, something that has been very contentious over the past 24 hours. And really, uh, you've seen a lot of pressure, both from his fellow ca candidates who have been saying that they hope he reverses himself, and al also from other uh, groups who are involved in the abortion uh, rights fight. And Biden today is saying that he really, uh, seeing that women's uh, health is under assault, especially in states that mm -hmm. are pushing to pass bills uh, relating to abortion restrictions that he could no longer uh, support this amendment. Jim. Arlette Signs on it tonight. Thanks very much. Perspective now from a seasoned Politico, along with the CNN political analyst, former Pelosi chief of staff, Danny Weiss, and CNN political analyst, uh, and also USA Today columnist, uh, Kirsten Powers. Uh, to both of you, this is quite a turnaround. Kirsten, I'll give you the honors yeah. here, uh, you know, stealing, in effect, what had been a line of attack yeah. from his Democratic opponents. I mean, this is incredible. It was just yesterday that his he was basically had his campaign saying that he wasn't going yeah. to reverse his position. He obviously knows what the Hyde Amendment is. It's not like this is suddenly news to him. Yeah. And so this is a clear cave to the pressure that he was getting because it's not like he got new information. Right. Uh, the reason that the Democrats have the position that they now have is precisely because of what he said is that they don't want to make abortion something that's only legal for people who have money. Right, right. Danny, smart reversal? Yeah, the, the Obama administration was one of the strongest defenders of a woman rights to, woman's right to choose, and uh, Vice President Biden was part of that effort. Uh, it's a smart of him to make this decision. Uh, he is a devout Catholic, but he is a strong, very strong defender of a woman's right to choose. It's a good move.